This patient has traveled 8,000 miles to be here. He is about to undergo surgery that is illegal in his own country. His doctors believe he is taking a huge risk. The science is unproven, and there's a real danger that his heart isn't strong enough to pull through surgery. David Traub has come to Bangkok, Thailand, to have stem cells injected directly into his heart. He's one of the growing number of foreigners traveling to East Asia, where stem cell medicine has been fast-tracked. With stem cell technology, we're now on the verge of a medical revolution. But many don't want to wait a moment longer. They want access to stem cell treatment now. In parts of Asia, doctors are bypassing clinical trials and offering stem cell treatment they claim can cure the incurable. Patients are gambling their lives on a science untried and untested. Will the gamble be worth the risk? Well, I'm David Traub. I'm an interior designer from Los Angeles, California. I've worked with many entertainers, I've done many homes. I've worked with Lucille Ball, Carol Burnett, Barbara Streisand. The lifestyle is expensive, but everybody's got to be somewhere, and I prefer not to be in Iowa. Jay and I have been together about 20 years now, and uh, we're married, and uh, legally, in, in God bless Canada. <laughs> yes, yes, in Canada. And uh, we love the United States. We have to leave the United States to go to Canada to get married. We have to leave the United States to come to Bangkok to get a treatment for my heart, which now the United States is starting to do clinical trials on, but only in its infancy. Here's to you and a wonderful trip. I hope we're going to have a fabulous party on your return. David is leaving the U.S. and traveling to Thailand, where he can electively undergo stem cell treatment for his ailing heart. Rather than proceed with a heart transplant, David wants to try a radical new treatment using stem cells to repair his damaged heart. It's a decision that's likely to change his life, one way or another. Thailand may not be the first place that comes to mind when you think of medical advancement. As a developing nation, it has typically looked to the West for trends in medical science. But recent developments have put Thailand ahead in the game. And it's now rushing to be part of Asia's biomed boom. Bangkok Hospital has set its sights on becoming a leader in the field of stem cell medicine. It's the only place in the world where stem cell surgery is commercially offered to patients suffering heart disease. Foreigners like David are now traveling to Thailand for stem cell treatment for severe heart failure. But how do stem cells work? Stem cells are the master cells, the primitive building blocks that divide and multiply to become all the cells in our body. At the earliest stages of human development, our bodies are being powered by embryonic stem cells. These early stem cells give rise to all the cells in our body that form our skin, bones and organs. Stem cells are driving who we will become and what we'll look like. As we grow older, adult stem cells act as the body's natural repair mechanism. They divide and specialize into the cells that need repair or replacement as we age. 
Adult stem cells are found in our bones, blood, heart and brain. Stem cells are even found inside our noses. The power of adult stem cells is only beginning to be realized. Previously it was thought adult stem cells could only repair the tissues from which they originated. But manipulated by chemical growth factors in the lab, adult stem cells have been coaxed into becoming many different cell types including blood cells, fat cells, liver cells and nerve cells. It's this ability to manipulate stem cells that has researchers excited. For the first time in history, scientists are able to regenerate damaged tissue in the lab by injecting it with a new supply of stem cells. This means chronic illness could be treated with a boost of stem cells to the injured site. While the science is promising, there's still a long way to go before treatment is regulated for human use. But in Thailand, cardiologist Dr. Kit believes adult stem cells are safe, effective, and he's already using them on patients. And they are very clear there are two groups of the physician. One that do believe and one absolutely do not believe it. And this the patient telling me all the time, say, Doc, uh, my cardiologist don't approve of I'm being here. My doctors that I've spoken with have had an interesting reaction. They're very interested from a clinical standpoint in what's going to happen. They can't wait to see the test results, but they don't